please rise to the pledge to the flag. Please rise to the pledge to the flag. Good morning, Central, and welcome back to this Galactic Friday, December 16th edition of CTV. Today is the day six. I'm Dom Solo. And I'm Luke. Luke Skywalker. Luke Sorry. There you go. 2016 graduate Tyler Van Wick will be here on December 20th during lunches to speak on the U.S. Army and ROTC. He is passionate about his decision and wishes to share the benefits of joining. Please stop by and speak with Tyler about the many career opportunities. First semester interns, internship papers are due in the Career Center by today, December 16th. <clears throat> Student Council will be hosting a Holiday Spirit Week starting next Monday. Show your holiday school spirit by participating. Monday, holiday headwear, no mask. Tuesday, blizzard whiteout. Wednesday, red and green day. Thursday, Santa's Little Helpers, Panther Pantry food drive. And Friday, ugly sweater day. For Thursday, Santa's Little... Santa, Santa's Little Helper's Day, please, please bring a can and box good to, to your CLC for the Panther Pantry to help Sanders. out. <laughs> Families in need this holiday season. Have a happy holidays from the Student Council. Roar! <laughs> Senior shirts and hoodies are soon going to be extinct. Limited sizes are still available. Seniors, please stop by room 621 if you'd like to purchase one. Last Saturday was the annual Brandywine Wrestling Tournament. The Central York team took third place out of 12 teams overall. I'm just Musty and I'm at the annual Brandywine Wrestling Tournament. The Brandywine Wrestling Tournament was held near Kutztown, PA and is held from 9.30 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. Brandywine Wrestling Tournament has a total of 12 teams in it and over 100 competitors. Mason Myers, a rookie freshman, took first place at the Brandywine Wrestling Tournament, and Mike Wolfgram, a sophomore, took first place also. So I got third place at the Brandywine Tournament. Fairly decent. Um, there's always room for improvement. Um, overall, our team did excellent, I think, um, especially for the first tournament. We have a young team filled with sophomores and uh, freshmen, and I think we came out strong, ready for the next one. Uh, I think I performed pretty well, considering my age, but there's always room for improvement. And we had a number of guys uh, place throughout the day, which led us to take uh, third overall. We were two points behind second place team uh, without wrestling at two different weight classes, so it was a pretty good weekend. This is Jason Musty signing out for CTV. Have a great day. NEHS will be hosting a coffee house on December 21st in the Hub at 7 p.m. Coffee will be provided and food will be available for purchase. If you're interested in signing up to perform poetry, sing, etc., please see Mrs. Detweiler in room 507. Give a little extra this holiday season and help to give animals and help give to animals in need. Central's Do Something Club is collecting items for the Adams County SPCA's wish list. The SPCA is in need of canned cat food, dry kitten food dry grain-free dog food, antibacterial wipes, garbage bags of 55 and 13 gallon sizes, paper towels, dish soap, and fleece blankets. Drop off your donations to Mrs. Weaver in room 512 by Friday, December 23rd. Grab a meal at Chipotle on Yum. December 19th to promote National English Honor Society during checkout. During checkout, mention <laughs> that you are for Essentials NEHS or show them a flyer. Promote a good cause while eating some good food. Congrats to the girls' JV and varsity basketball teams for their wins last night. Wait, that was two nights ago. Against Dallastown. Come out Friday for their next home game. That's, that's today. today. Yeah, Woo! that's also Congratu today. Congratulations, girls. The Life Skills class will be selling soap on Wednesday, December 21st in the cafeteria from 9 to 1240. This holiday soap sale will have lots of Christmas soaps to purchase, such as angels, snowflakes, snowmen, gingerbread men, and much more. Prices will range for... 150 to four dollars. It makes nice stocking stuffers. There will be a mandatory meeting for all students involved with Sister Act on Wednesday, December 21st during Flex in the Coral Room. 
If you cannot make this meeting, you must see Mr. Zortman ahead of time if you want to be involved with the show. If you have not already set up an account with Stage Management, you must do so before this meeting. Follow the directions in the email sent to you or on the Performing Arts Department web page. Today in the Black Box Theater, Improvenia is back. Yes. Tickets are five dollars. Wait, why am I up there? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want for Christmas, dear? I want an improv promo that actually grabs people's attention. Okay, next. What do you want for Christmas, dear? I want world domination. Oh, yes. Okay, next. What do you want for Christmas, dear? I want a non-food suggestion. Okay. <laughs> what do you want for Christmas, son? I, I, I want... Give me the end, grab me up on December 16th from 7 to 9 p.m. It's gonna be lit. Be there. Because what day of the week this one's gonna be on? What, okay, what day? It's gonna be on Friday! Friday! You get the idea. It's only five dollars to get in! Be there! That's my son. Wait a minute. You're not even a real Santa! And that concludes another edition of CTV. Let's make it a great day to be a Panther. <laughs> we don't do this, we just like, we do this, and then we just do this.